Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In PowerPoint, you can use SmartArt to easily incorporate charts and other types of diagrams into presentations without having to individually create all of the shapes and connectors between boxes in a flowchart or diagram. To insert SmartArt, click the SmartArt button that appears in the Illustrations button group on the Insert tab of the ribbon, or click the Insert a SmartArt Graphic button inside any content placeholder within a slide. Either way, the Choose a SmartArt Graphic dialog box will appear. You will use this dialog box to select what type of SmartArt graphic you want to insert into your presentation slide. You can select a category from the listing of categories at the left side of the dialog box to view its contents in the pane to the right. You can then click on a graphic shown in this list to read its name and how to use it in the far right pane in the dialog box. When you have the SmartArt graphic to insert selected, click the OK button to insert the selected SmartArt graphic into your presentation. You can then click on the individual shapes within the SmartArt graphic and type the text that you want to enter into the selected shape. You can also type text directly into the text pane that appears along with your SmartArt graphic. Notice that when the SmartArt graphic is selected, you will also see a new contextual tab appear within the ribbon. This is the SmartArt Tools contextual tab. Within it are the Design and Format tabs. You will use the buttons and commands within these two tabs to set the layout and appearance of your selected SmartArt. Note that there are multiple individually selectable shapes contained within a single piece of SmartArt. You can click the various shapes to enter text, and click and drag them to resize and reposition them within the larger SmartArt graphic as desired. You can also click and drag the large outer border of the SmartArt graphic to move the entire graphic without disturbing the placement of the elements inside the graphic. You can resize it by placing your mouse pointer over the resizing handles that surround the border, and then clicking and dragging when your mouse pointer turns into the double pointed arrow. When you want to delete the entire SmartArt graphic, Click its border to select it, and then press the Delete or Del key on your keyboard to delete the entire SmartArt graphic. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.